Hi, my name is Ahmed and welcome back to Dubai Real Estate Philosophy. In this video, we're going to be talking about Rogue Home Marasi Drive. So Rogue Hotels is a very famous hotel chain in Dubai. If you live in Dubai, I'm sure you've seen them around. They have over nine branches in Dubai. Rogue is basically a partnership between Amar and Maras, two very well-known developers. Top of their game, they basically came together to build a hotel chain that's going to be three, four stars rather than the five star. And of course, the world's only seven star hotel, the Burj Al Arab here in Dubai. Dubai is known for its bling. So these two, they decided to come together and make something that's a three to four star hotel with their kind of design ethos and amazing chic style quality and design and interiors and all these things. This is going to be a residential project. Now, the developer for this project is called Earth, I-R-T-H. This is basically the Shamsi family. It's a very well-known Marathi family. They also happen to own Pan Homes. So this is a fully furnished option right in the heart of Dubai in Business Bay in Marasi Drive. I do believe that this is one of the better options that is available right now in the market, especially when it comes to the location, the pricing, and it comes fully furnished with an amazing brand, Rove Hotels. Moving on to the presentation, as you can see, this is about the brand, the Rove brand. They had a building launch in a downtown as well, Rove Home, which was downtown. So that project was launched, you know, a couple of months ago. It was very successful. It is sold out now, and uh, they're going to continue those kind of similar styles and everything in this second one in Marasi Drive as well. So for those of you who missed that opportunity, they're doing another launch. It's happening right now. It's a great time to get into the heart of Dubai. Now, moving on to this slide, basically, as you can see, it shows you the reasons, the things, the beliefs that, you know, Rogue really does stand for. You can see that they have community, central urban location. So as I just mentioned, they had a launch in downtown, which is already sold out. They had another launch will be going to be in Business Bay. Rove inspired design. So as I mentioned, it's like a chic lifestyle. It's a very fun, playful lifestyle. It will be a bit different design than the downtown. For those of you who remember downtown, it was very pop, you know, red color, this, that, everywhere. This is a bit more softer tone design. Nevertheless, you know, that amazing funky pop style design when it comes to the interiors and everything and as i mentioned earth does own pan homes as well so it does come fully furnished they do know how to do their furniture as well that is an amazing option that they are also giving in this project moving on to the fully loaded amenities as you can see also that's one of their things and their add-on services so amenities when it comes to this building this building will have over 50 amenities that is an insane number if you can say it we're gonna get uh, to the amenities into each one specifically a bit later on in the slide add-on services is a very very cool service where you can have your concierge they can arrange drivers for you they can arrange a chef for you they can arrange a housemate for you they can do the laundry for you all these things are pay as you go just like you're living in a hotel style as well these are only residential apartments so there's going to be no hotel guests or tourists or all these things so it is only for residents and of course you can you know apart from the people who are letting it out on airbnb be or short-term or long-term rentals. This is like something that's amazing when it comes to add-on services by Rogue Hotels themselves. Moving on to the location, it is on the intersection of the Marasi Drive and Al Asail Street right in front of the flyover. It is a corner plot, very well centrally located. It's a bit away from the hustle and bustle. Of course, everyone knows Business Bay downtown. They're known for their traffic jams and their congestion. Of course, as we all know, RTA is, you know, trying to fix and improve those things day in and day out. It's not too much in the center. It's on an intersection section so traffic of course look peak times you really can't get away with traffic here in dubai in any place but on throughout the day it is nice smooth flowing traffic what that location does give us is because it is a corner plot and it is an l-shaped building you do get entire views of the dubai skyline you do get views of burj khalifa and right behind it if you're not facing the burj khalifa and all that dubai holdings which owns a lot of plot maintains a lot of business bay has finally decided to make parks as well. The first park that is coming in Business Bay and downtown is going to be right behind Rogue Hotel. Units at the back will have that park view and the units at the front will be having that Dubai skyline view. So when it comes to location, it is very, very well located. They have chosen an amazing plot. Again, it goes to show, you know, the earth developer, the family, the Shamsi family, they're very well connected. They, you know, managed to secure this amazing plot and managed to secure a partnership with Imar and Miraz for this Rogue Hotel development. This comes to the design of the building. As you can see in this, we have the podium. Then I believe, you know, we have in the middle, there's also going to be a sky garden and then on the rooftop and all these three things are packed filled with amenities the podium sky garden has different tile type of amenities and the rooftop of course has a lot of different amenities and this is one of the few projects that also have a landscaping consultant along with them because there is so much landscaping that they have to do very different from your typical roof your typical sky garden and your typical podium level because there's so much landscaping
anything. They have thought of everything. We showcase a lot of properties over here, but this is you know, really one of those properties that the developers have really, really thought about every single thing and design aspect in their building. Another fun thing, so this building will be consisting of studios, one beds and two beds. Rove hotels, they do not make three or four beds. They have come up with another thing in studio, which is very, very unique in the market. This is the first time anyone has brought this up in Dubai. They have partnered up with a company called Ori, O-R-I. This is an American company and for their studios, of course, everyone knows studios are small, but they have come up with an ingenious idea in Ori. They do have some scientists from MIT who help them develop this hydraulic system where their bed, your studio at nighttime can turn into your bedroom and in the morning can turn into your living room it is a hydraulically powered thing so as you saw in this video it is very simple it's very safe and it's very very effortless one push of a button your bed goes up now you have a living room one push of a button now you have a living room moving on to the basically the entrance of the building this will have a three-story high entrance lobby for those of you who want to see this right now you can go into any row hotel in dubai they have amazing entrance experience they have a co-working space they have the row food truck which is like a nice hippie Volkswagen van it's like a cafe there you can buy purchase stuff you know your croissants and your coffees in the morning you can just order from there you have a co-working space the lobby it's an amazing hotel style experience even though it's a residential building the lobby will be three stories high made of glass instead of you know just like the concrete jungle most of this building will be from the outside at least it will be constructed with stone glass and metal now moving on to the building structure as we mentioned earlier you can see there will be basically three basements okay the ground floor as as it says over here it's five to eight meters high so we are talking about almost three stories high and uh, they will be having four podiums okay so they have that so there's massive amount of space for parking every owner basically every residence gets one parking space and then of course there's massive loads of space for parties and your guests family and friends who can come and visit you now moving on they have basically five to 21 levels and from that after that they do have the sky garden which we'll get to in more detail in the you know front of the slide and then after that we do have our 21st till 31st floor and then we have the rooftop which is also packed filled with amenities now moving on to the amenities so as you can see ground level as i mentioned they do have a rove cafe they have a convenience store so a lot of buildings in business bay they sometimes you know have a lot of retail at the ground floor you might have a nail salon you might have a pet shop but you don't have a convenience store you can't just walk in and get a ball of milk or something like that it's you know you're, you're gonna have to order that or something so rove has thought about that the first thing that will be going in there is a convenience store you can directly order from there they do have a cafe as i mentioned moving on they have co-working spaces they have soundproof meeting rooms they have general meeting rooms Rooms. okay they have outdoor space so as i mentioned again from their experience being a three to four star hotel they're bringing all that into their residences now in robe home marasi drive moving to the podium level they have a urban beach pool so this beach pool will be having sand and all those kind of things as well we have a kids pool aqua cycling you know a bit more resistance training they have sun lounge decks you know yoga jacuzzi uh, of course there's a fully equipment gym and there's also a rove beverage truck as i mentioned rove they do do food trucks and all these things so on the podium level they'll have one of their food trucks you can be lying down if you want a juice you can go buy a juice right there maybe a club sandwich something like that to chill out hang out in that nice afternoon you can go and do that right there from the vicinity of your own podium when it comes to more of the indoor things they do have a lot of other things they do have a gaming lounge they have guest rooms they have changing rooms as i mentioned fully equipped gym they have a multi-purpose room with the kitchen so you can throw some parties there you can pick the room for your entire to celebrate wonderful moments with your family now talking about the sky garden they do have a lot of uh things when it comes to sports as i mentioned you know paddle ping pong amphitheater you can see that in that same area they do have you know by daytime it could be a sports sports area where you got you can play basketball football tennis all these things with beautiful views Burj Khalifa and at nighttime it can turn into an amphitheater basically they'll be playing their movies every night as well so at 7 p.m they will inform the residents that hey you know this evening we're playing this movie you can feel free to join it uh, in the evening so you can go and have a nice time with your friends and your family so uh, these are just you know few of the amenities I'm not gonna go over all of them there are quite a lot of amenities we really can go over if you guys have in-depth more detailed questions feel free to let me know in the comments below and we'll continue on with this presentation moving on as we can see these are some like renderings of the podium level okay podium level as you can see it's not your average podium it is beautiful same thing with the rooftop it is not your average rooftop it is very very well made now moving on one of the things as i mentioned earlier they have studios one bed and two beds now any typical de developer you, if there's something you want downtown views with burj al khalifa views and all these things usually they're three to four beds one two beds they're usually facing backward whereas this building all of the one and two bedrooms will be facing forward because of course they don't have three and four so this is an amazing opportunity to get a one one or two bedroom facing towards the skyline. 
Now, the last and final thing, of course, the most important thing when it comes to the pricing, we have basically studios. They're starting from around 1 million and the one bed will be starting from around 1.6 million and two bedrooms will be starting from around 2.4 million. It's a 50-50 payment plan and this building will be done relatively soon in quarter one of 2027. So this was just a quick presentation on basically the project. Uh, you guys can come down to the sales center. They do have basically that bed I was talking about by Ori. And I really do believe that this is one of the last projects that are available. As you all know, in downtown and business bay, there's plots are reducing, especially all the prime location plots are already taken. So this is one of the last few plots that is with a very amazing location. There's a lot, a lot of details which we can get into, but then this video will get too long. So if you guys are interested in this project, if you are looking to live in centrally, uh, you know, located Dubai and with, um, you know, great pricing, because this pricing is very, very fair. Because if you think about it in JVC, you can get a one bed for 900,000. Whereas over here for 900,000 to almost close to a million, around a million, you're getting a studio. Yes, it's smaller, but of course you're in the heart of Dubai and you're getting it fully furnished with an amazing payment plan and it's quite quick delivery i believe this is a great investment opportunity because it's very centrally located and as we all know branded residences they do turn you know tend to make a lot of capital appreciation and especially great roi already a hotel lifestyle i mean it's very easy for you to do airbnb of course all that stuff is open by the developer you are free to let it off on airbnb and uh, of course enjoy all those great uh, rental returns. I do work with Eon and Trissel. We have a lot of exclusivity with Rove, with Okta Properties. We have great relationship with them and we have sold a lot of their properties in the past. This helps us get exclusive units with them. It is an amazing product in my opinion, as you can see from the presentation. If you guys have any comments or questions, feel free to let me know. Thank you so much for watching this video. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye for now. And you can conveniently reach out to me directly on my WhatsApp by scanning the QR code at the top right corner.